Uh, I know that other hangout's just gonna have to die by itself. There's nothing I can do to, to uh, stop it. As soon as somebody comes in here, they'll tell them on the other uh, tell them on the other channel that I am live over here. So good evening, everybody. Welcome to Guerneville, California. So if somebody could go over to the other chat and just let them know that I had to begin a new one. That other one will die off. We got the Rio Fest. Right. Yeah, thank you, McDave. If you could go over to the other uh, chat and just tell them that I had to begin a new live stream to close out all the windows. I should have done that to begin with. I'm really stupid in that regard. Uh, got here. Looks better, I'm glad. I don't like a pixelated thing and I probably had a few things open so if you can let people know in the other chat thank you thank you uh, Anna if you can let people know in the other chat that I am back it would be appreciated let's go out to the bridge and take a look let's go down to the theater first Here we are. Russian River Realty since 1939 we are chooching tonight Glad to see everybody. There's quite a few people in town tonight. This, of course, is the LGBTQRSTUVWXYZ, capital of the county here. Baby goats. Just what I need. Baby goats, right? Russian River Realty since 1939. We'll go see what a place goes for down here on the river. And back in the 1920s, 30s, 18, late 1800s, this is where people came up for summer vacation from the city. 150 years, Guerneville. Thank you, Megan. I appreciate it. This is your kind of town, Megan. There's the eagle up there. Flying around. Riding the thermals, baby. Rip some bird's nuts off right there. All right, let's go down here before we go out on the bridge there. Yeah, it's fun. I haven't been up here probably in six months. I can't remember the last time I was up here. Yeah, sorry, Jody, if you could let them know in the other chat that uh, I had to begin a new one. I never know if it's going to allow me to resume. Sometimes it doesn't allow me to resume the chat and it just has to die. So I apologize for that. I don't know if they're gonna open the uh, the river theater here. This is supposed to be a hell of a place for breakfast, river and grill. Might have to try that sometime. Yeah, it's choochin time. Choochin time. Getting a tattoo on my shoulder is gonna be oh that'll be nice. Snow Leopard will be pretty awesome, kitty. That's good. All the license plates. Love to see a menu here. That's exciting. I want to get it. I wanted to get a tattoo on my private region. Let's see if we got a menu here. Eggs Benedict. Omelets. Yeah, sorry, Charla. Doggone it. The buttermilk pancakes are pretty good, too, for $7.95. Might have to come out for breakfast. Two eggs, all in two. Eggs, all in two. Huevos Rancheros. See, the orange juice is reasonable. $2.50 if you want fresh squeezes. $4.50. 
coffee's $2.95 and not $4. That's okay, huh? That's all right. You'll have to come out of here sometime. Check this out. Yeah, sorry about that, Charla. They still doing, I don't know, the census for 2020 got all messed up, didn't it? The River Theater. Working on the sign here. No smoking anything. Doggone door is open here. Look at the pink elephant over there. <laughs> guy just rolled up on me. Very good looking guy. Had that nice shock of platinum hair there. The River Theater saved from condo development. I'll tell you, developers, those nasty developers are everywhere, aren't they? Oh, those greedy developers. Collectibles. Guerneville is very nice. It's the town in Sonoma County. It's close to Bohemian Grove, which is very controversial. Um, where all the male politicians and business leaders all gather for two weeks a year in the summertime, starting with Herbert Hoover, and just um, talk about stuff. And it became very controversial because all the liberals here, all the liberals here think it's, uh, they discuss nefarious things, you know? What's up, Roger Brown? Otherwise, the Russian Rivers was traditionally the playground before there was airline travel. People would come up by train, take the ferry across the Golden Gate, and then come up on the uh, Russian River. Uh, so you'll see a lot of homes. Back in here, here's the Armstrong Woods back there. Yeah, 4.1 earthquake. Yeah. We are in earthquake country. <laughs> Roof, roof. <laughs> Dog. Yeah, it does get dark here because we're down in a valley and with all these enormous redwoods and these high peaks, the sun goes down pretty early. But we'll have some fun. What's up, Joni? I like some of the old stuff. Eagle on the side of the building. Pretty cool. We're okay, it's only 83 in the living room. Okay, well, I think it's like a comfortable 80 here right now, something about that. Something around there. Like a little alley of doom here. By the theater. Man, I wish the guy would come out so I could take a look in there. But they're working in there. I guess they're I guess they're getting ready to uh, ready to reopen the theater. Yeah, I got my nice floral top on tonight. All right. So let's uh, let's take a look up on the bridge here. See what it looks like. See if I can get a cup of coffee in this town a little later. Sonoma Nesting Company, Art Antiques Decor. So this is a this is the uh, town that's noted to be the most LGBTQRSTUVWXYZ friendly out here. Hey, Quirky. It's kind of cool in there. I'm trying to get my phone 
battery charger. Thumbs up or appreciated if you've just come in, guys. Please hit the thumbs up button. Yeah, that's what it is. Let it go. Right? So, they had pride before pride was even cool up here. And this was a huge place for hippies in the 60s and 70s. And we'll go up on the old uh, 19, I think it's 1922 Guerneville Bridge here. We'll see what the, um, we'll see what the water flow looks like. Yeah, 1922. Still Guerneville Bridge. Yeah, sorry about that, Kale. I was over, uh, I was so pixelated, I had to close out everything and retry the stream. Sometimes it lets me resume it, but other times it makes me uh, close it out altogether. Yeah, I know you were on, I apologize, that stream will just wither and die. Everybody will come to where they don't allow uh, traffic on this anymore, obviously. This thing would not sustain in an earthquake. But it's had been here 99 years. There's people uh, partying. There's people with cabins and things here. So we'll slap around and see what the cabins and stuff are like. Is that Tito? Tito, how you doing, handsome Tito? Hey, Jasmine. I enjoy Tito at the casino with his uh, buffalo gold. His buffalo were running. What a nice night in Guerneville. This is all really overgrown now. Let's walk out of here and take a look. I would fly the drone here, but I don't have my, even my temporary license in hand yet. And this bridge is looking a little shaky. Thank you, Kale. So appreciated. This river level, level doesn't look too bad here. See, they don't allow you to walk on that. Cement anymore. Hello. Hey, maybe you find an airplane with that. We, lo we lost an airplane out in these trees out here. You did, huh? Yeah. Airplane or a drone? It, well, it's not drone, but it's an airplane. Oh, RC? Radio controlled? Yeah. And you lost it in the trees? Yeah. We were, we were out there on the beach over here, and it, we lost it in between these two bridges. So wow. Bushes. It's six foot wide span. Wow. Yeah, yeah sorry I didn't bring my drone. I could have put my drone up and see if it was in a... That's what we were talking about doing that. Yeah. Say we were seeing if we, we could find something. Yeah, so it, yeah, I have a drone, but I just passed my license for my drone FAA. But I don't have my paper temper yet, so I'm afraid to put it up because they're giving big fines now oh, for okay, flying. Right? Yeah. You, you, can, you can use it to... Oh, yeah, I can get above the trees and you probably see that oh, plane. Oh, gosh, that would be so perfect. Yeah. Do you have a card, or can I give you my number? Um, are you on YouTube? No. Okay. Well, if you know somebody on YouTube, I'm Rosie O'Kelly. Just think the Irish girl, O'Kelly, Rosie. Okay. And they can contact me. It's on my About page on YouTube, my contact information. Yeah, and if they want that. to, yeah, I can yeah. do that. They, somebody must be on YouTube, one of your friends or something. So. Yeah, yeah, I do have a friend that's on YouTube. Okay, well, let them know. Okay. You got it. Tell them to subscribe my channel and okay, I'll try and, to and get out Rosie? here. Rosie O'Kelly. Okay, thank you, Rosie. You have to just think the Irish girl, O'Kelly. You got it, okay? Rosie O'Kelly. Yeah. Okay, and your name is, what's your name? Kevin Denny. Kevin. Okay, Kevin. So okay. it went It went over here, right? Yeah. So you were following it up from Johnson's Beach down there. Yeah, we were down there on Johnson's Beach. Right. And we let somebody else fly it that doesn't know much about oh, it. Oh, geez, there's and, your problem. Yeah. yeah. And it landed. It kind of like went low, and we're thinking it's between the two bridges, but it's kind of hard. Yeah, it's hard to gauge from there. there. But if you have to go into this area, it's very difficult to negotiate because there's a lot of blackberry bushes and stuff down here. Yeah. Well, so, well, 
what I'm thinking is it wouldn't make it too far into the boat. Oh no, it would be very close. If it went into the yeah. side, it wouldn't go deep here. Right. You might be able to access it from the river side here. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. All right. Well, just tell them to look me up, Rosie O'Kelly. I have a drone, okay? Okay, so, you got it, Rosie. All right, thank you, Kev. Thank you. The beach, the river doesn't look real bad here, does it? It's pretty damn good. That's a pretty nice level on the Russian River right there. So I'm going to have to get my inner tube and start coming up here. Yeah, how you doing, Jasmine? This is what it looks like. These people have a lot of cottages on the river here. Yeah, sorry about the other, uh, sorry. I didn't, um, I don't know how to go back to the other chat once I start a new one. I can't go back over there. So this guy lost his, uh, they lost their RC plane in there. Yeah, well, I mean, if I can help, the thing's probably wedged up in a tree somewhere, and you can put, like, a fishing line, and you can just cast up into the trees. You might get a good... You might get it hooked there. I mean, but do, do you see the density of the uh, trees? Yeah, everyone loves Rosie. Well, God, I wish that was true. So the water is a little low. There's some grass growing up out of it. I wish we could walk over there, but that's too unstable, the, the bridge over there. You know? So it's really, um, it's not as low as I thought it would be. Not as low. Oh, thank you, Cheryl. I appreciate it. Hey, Emerald. How are you? Thank you, Liz. This is the money shots here. I have done cinematic. Guerneville was the very first cinematic one I did in 2019, I believe. Yeah, that's the Russian River. That's where we get our drinking water from, a lot of it. This is where all the salmon run up here. Mamas and dads should never fight over children's safety, freedom, and life. Hmm? Mamas and dads should never fight over children, children's safety. Looks like we missed something out here, huh? Yeah, I should be able to shoot it down. I've actually got a Beretta 9mm be able to see that plane in over there All right. thank you Roger I appreciate that see the density of those trees I mean it's gonna be very hard actually I think I see the plane I think it's right up I don't think that you can see it but I see the I see the plane it's hanging up in the trees up there between the, uh, uh, see the two peaks to the right, just go up to the left. And just between, like right, right in here, there's a plane right up there. You can see the white, you can see the white dot of the fuselage right up there. See it? Yeah, sorry, Chef. I screwed everybody on that. The stream was so pixelated. There's the plane right there. See that white dot? Right there. Right in the middle. There it is. That's the fuselage right in the trees there. Yep, you see it? Oh, there it is. So if I see the guy again. There it is hanging up there. That's what you call 
pilot eyes right there. Hey, Mandy, glad to see you. Just felt an earthquake in the East Bay. Didn't really feel it, but I'll bet Janet felt it in Fairfield. Hey, Pecan. Uh, thank you, sweetie. Yeah, I know it's late in the UK. I do appreciate you popping by. It's just a beautiful time of night. Yeah, I got the uh, got the denims. That's it. That's right. The hell am I gonna do that? Let's see. What the hell did I do now? I gotta get that off of there. There we go. Get that shit off of there. There we go. Sorry, I'm trying to adjust on Bella Rose. How you doing? But I definitely see the plane up there. Definitely up there between those trees. But that's a good. It's a good 140 feet off the ground. That's right, the international symbol of fine chuchin right there. Except no substitute. Go to the end here. This bridge is shaky. I don't want to be on this when uh, the earthquake hits here. We miss you, Daddy Jason. No, they're not going to be able to recover that. I think that's um, that's going to be a write-off up there. I just don't think that you're going to, ain't nobody going to climb. I can sure as hell see the thing right in the tree there. I see the wings on it, but you ain't going to be able to get it. And that's the bottom line. Yep, rosy long legs. As I wish my legs weren't so long. This is where I sunbathe over here on the grass. This is nice here kind of go down to the river they got like a park down there yeah they might have uh, chef but this is this is kind of an impractical place to uh, jump what's gonna have probably happen is you're gonna end up in a paraplegic for life or quadriplegic you want to go down to the water or not yeah, it's not enough to finish the job. I hear people on the river coming down in a boat. So. What a beautiful view. I guess the river is down a little bit. I don't know. I'm surprised. Doesn't look too, too bad. There's a lot of beach there. That's some of the nicest water you want to swim in, but the problem is it's got like rocky bottom to it. So you got to have like flip flops on. It's like a gravelly stuff. Yeah, we're going to go down to the water. We're going to see some of the cabins here and what some of the people are doing. As you can see some people have cabins. They got their boats tied up over there. Upstream. How you doing, Lieutenant Dan? So, let's get the damn crows. Let's see if we can get a coffee in town. Monday night's going to be a little problematic. Yeah, thank you, Melissa. I'm always honored to see you on the stream. Used to swim in a creek. Yeah, it's nice, Princess. Nice to see you, too. This damn bridge is going to go at any time. That earthquake's just going to snap those babies. Boom! And there goes 99 years. Right. The weather is, I would say, 78 degrees. No breeze. I have my jacket in the car in case I need it later. 
we still got about uh, two and a half hours to real dark here. You hear people partying down here. Yeah, it's beautiful weather tonight. Just beautiful. Glad to have you guys along. Look at that nice house up on the hill here. They got like a river view down there. Right there. Got some big hills around here. I'd say that radio control plane is probably gone. It gone. It gone. Hey, Catherine. Yeah, it's a beautiful night in Guerneville tonight. It's a very mellow town. They've always had a significant homeless problem here, though. Just because people are very mellow, their attitude, so. Grab a cup of coffee and chill out a bit. Generation H. Never even heard of Generation H. I must have missed uh, D E F G. Generation G. Ladies are out for a stroll. Should we see some prices on the Russian River? They'll probably um, probably have some prices for Rio Nido too. Rio Nido was very famous in the 1920s and 30s on the river for their big dance, um, their big dance platform, and all their carnival games, and a beautiful uh, beach with multiple lifeguards, and all the big bands of the era would come up and play there: uh, Ozzy, Nelson, Sammy K, Tommy Dorsey. They would all play at the Rio Nido. There's a lot of Santa Rosa. Hidden Valley Road, Guerneville. Two bedroom, one bath, 489. Can't really see the reflection. Monterio is another place. Look at how tiny. One bedroom, one bath, 599. Jeez. There's no land at all. Dang. You believe that, Cheryl? It's like, really? Mary Mounts, your notary. I like those shifty eyes, huh? Those eyes shifty? Look at these tiny little shack here. Monterio, 359. One bedroom, one full bath, 594 square feet. Jeez. Ridiculous. <coughs> oh, somebody bought the damn thing. Look at that. 600,000 for that little thing. Holy crap. Sold. Oh yeah, 
boy. This must be blown out. 1933 home. 299. Must be something really wrong with it. Must be rotten as hell. You can see the water damage. All right. This looks like bullshit. Washed out, yeah. I don't know if we can still, I don't know if we can get a cup of coffee. I don't even know if I was here, I think I was here during the pandemic. Boar's head. The prices are insane. It's probably closed. Well, it used to be a coffee place. Now it's like a property broken. Casadero, there's a place in Jenner. 2.5 million, that's where the Russian River meets the sea. Look at that. We're living a high life, aren't they? Come on. I don't know if these guys are closed or not. Yeah, they're done. Who's playing music? What's up, Teresa? How you doing? Armstrong Woods. This is where the flooding was so bad. Two years ago, you can just put in my search box, Gurnville flooding. It was so bad, the water was like uh, three feet high here. And I talked to a guy that had the hardware store down here. Playing in there. Let's head down here. See, they got a little cottage for sale here. I don't know what street this is. This is Third Street. What number is this, Cheryl? Third Street. Vanguard Properties. Third Street. Sixteen two two one one six two two one. It's actually a pretty good sized house, but the uh, problem is flooding here. This Russian River can be a monster. The year before I moved here, I remember watching NBC Nightly News. Houses just coming off of the sides of the hills and gone down the river. It was terrible. This can really be a terror, this Russian river. That's why I say between earthquakes, floods, and fires, this is the most dangerous place climatologically, geologically, hydrologically to live in America here. So I never knew the Masonic Lodge was here. Look at that house. Kids up there, I think, blowing a bowl or injecting himself, one or the other. Maybe they'll get a job. <laughs> Here's a novel thought. 
Maybe they'll get a job. Main Street Station. Of course, when you're out on the street and you say that, that's the three dirtiest words in the English language. If somebody, that's what got me in trouble with uh, Quinn and led to that confrontation, right? Get a job. You talk about being triggered. Man, look at this mess over here. Check flooding, yeah. Look at this mess. There's a guy laying in the middle of this shit. He looks like a beach whale. I guess he got evicted. Look, oh shit, this is all homeless people here. Nice doggy. Hello. Nice. See that? Oh. For what was that? Nine. Man, I can't believe it. I just walked right in the middle of all that. Wow. Holy smokes. That was spooky. I didn't see that coming. That was scary as hell. I didn't see that coming. Country coffee. Oh man. I'm back there guys. Sorry about that. I don't know if you guys can hear me or not. I think we might be back. Uh, know in a minute if I'm back, if I'm back, if I'm back, if I'm back. Don't know if I'm back yet it's back boy did you guys miss a show down there boy oh boy did you miss a show I can't even begin to tell you what the hell happened on that street yeah I know I'm fuzzy I know I'm fuzzy I'm just in a bad area I'm just glad I could not believe I could not believe what the hell I walked into back there. I literally thought I was in the Tenderloin in San Francisco. It was so bad. This guy came up, pulled his pants down and pulled his wang around and was flashing me down there. It was bad, really bad. Yeah, I'm fine, you know. I was talking to the um, people. I knew my signal would degrade back there, and they're talking about how everything's terrible back there on Third Street now. They have, they literally have, you know, 50 bums homeless back there, and said that they have just destroyed the town. Dan, that's why you're not a mod on my channel, right? Just in case you were wondering. No, I don't have pepper spray. Who expected that back there? No way in my life did I expect that, to walk into that. Are you kidding me? I thought, what's this guy, the first guy, laying on the ground there? And I thought, what the hell's going on down here? Right? Yeah, Dan, WTF. Let's see if I can get a coffee. <laughs> 